There's other good safety news we have. This, this time it's on the runway. I'm pleased to say that the EAA has worked with us and really been helpful with a lot of good input on runway safety, pushing for the type of training that will make the runways as safe as we can make them. And as you know, uh, runway safety and the environment around the runway is, has become one of, of our primary focus. We've got to reduce the number of accidents and the number of runway incursions in this business. We are making headway, and our runway safety initiative has been significant, and it includes enhancements to runway, taxiway signage, uh, all of the various components, the markings, the lightings, uh, all improvements around the airport geometry. We're making changes to ATC procedures and instructions for clarity. As pilots in this audience you know, already know, we've heightened awareness among you. Uh, any of you that get some of the online streams, posters that you see in, in the various offices and, and the fixed base operators have been terrific about putting those up for us, all of that to raise awareness. Uh, we're also introducing new technology, for example, the new runway status lights that you'll see. And in fact, we're now in the, in the process of evaluating some low-cost uh, runway safety systems that we can deploy into a lot of smaller airports. So it's, uh, it's a very broad-based uh, initiative and one that will bring us, a, I think, a huge step forward uh, as we eliminate, uh, the, you know, I have to come back here in a couple of years and say we just don't have runway incursions anymore. The uh, actual number, uh, some of the things that we've done from the initiatives that we have put forward are bearing really good results. For example, the uh, runway incursions are down 7% from a year ago, but the serious incursions, the, the A's and the B's, where they're really serious, the possibility of a collision, are down 70% from last year. More work to do, but that's a remarkable step forward. Uh, however, with that said, I'm giving you the gross rates. We still have almost two per day, uh, over 70 per month. Uh, that's not acceptable. We've got to do better than that, and we will work with you. Uh, we, we have other initiatives, as I said, that are moving forward, but that's not an acceptable rate. Uh, we've got to move that number towards zero. And for those of us who have been flying in the system for years, these uh, incursions uh, aren't you know, surprising, but they, they point to a lot of things that we actually have control over. We can do a lot with technology, but we can't do anything about inattentiveness. We can't do anything about uh, casual distractions that we probably should have ignored but decided to attend to. We can do things like if you're unfamiliar with the airport, the time to understand the airport layout and where you're going to go after you land is not on short final. Take the time to understand the airport and take the time to brief yourself. You take all the time to draw the en route process that you're going to go through. Take the time to look at those airport charts. Misunderstanding of an ATC instruction. All you have to do is say, I didn't quite get that, or say that again to me so that I understand. Simple little things that we can do, common sense that you all have uh, will go a long ways. I think the takeaway here is just simply be focused. And I think if, if all of us rededicate a little time uh, and, and consideration to it uh, of how important this is, it's one of the areas uh, that still leaves us a lot of room to make improvement. Aero TV is brought to you by Cirrus Design's Vision SJ50 single engine personal jet offers exceptional fuel efficiency, flexible seating for up to seven, advanced avionics, and all the Cirrus safety features you expect, including the Cirrus airframe parachute system. With its V-tail design, the Cirrus Vision is technologically advanced, yet engineered to be simple to fly, to allow owner pilots more lifestyle pursuits than any other personal aircraft. Learn more about the Vision SJ50 at CirrusDesign.com.